Hey everybody, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to World of Warcraft Retail and our Monk playthrough. Today we are starting off by uh, launching some fireworks and doing something with a playful Crimson Serpent. So, let's go check this out. There's a fireworks launcher right over here. There's the little serpent. He looks pretty cute. Wonder if there's a reason for us to go in here. Uh, there may be. <laughs> it, it does seem like there may be some objectives underground here. Oh, very cool. Uh, we need a scryer staff. I I'm not really sure why it's highlighting all these guys. Maybe they have a chance to drop it. Well, they didn't drop it. <laughs> we uh, we fought quite a few of them. Uh, let's take a closer look at the quest. Yeah, they've made off with the staff, so one of these water elementals does indeed have the item. Let's get some health back here. Well, that missed everybody. Perfect. And there we go. I am but an old Jinyu, and those pesky water sprites were impossible to catch. Speak to Elder Sage Ron Zhu near the courtyard in the Temple of the Jade Serpent in the Jade Forest. What else is going on down here? Uh, it's possible that there are other serpents we need to find. Alright, how do we get back to the quest givers? You have the eyes of one who has traveled much. Where are you from? Have fun! Looks like we have at least two more serpents we need to find. Here's the Crimson Serpent.
And the Golden Serpents. All the serpents have been collected. Yes, I can hear you. Moths have infested moths have infested the library. Moths. Any librarian worth his letters knows that moths are the most dangerous threat to paper, second only to bookworms. As it turns out, my assistants are useless a useless bunch of insect fearing cowards. Please you must help me get rid of the moths immediately. My tiger guide. And no pages steps. of history. The worst possible thing has happened, Orc. We have bookworms. This is a critical situation. All bookworms in the library must be eradicated at once to prevent their spread. We must squash this problem. Literally, please examine the infested books in the library and squash any bookworms that be you find. Careful. Okay, then. Infested book. Oh, we're not... We're gonna click them. Okay, we're not gonna walk over them. We're gonna click them and then stop them. Let's see, we, we will take uh, the boots of the boots, let's take the crits. Stay safe. You've helped us more than you can ever imagine. I do not know what I would do if our precious scrolls were ever to be lost. Please return to the Elder Sage Ron Zhu and tell him that the library is in order. Be careful. Of you. you came to deliver a message to the Jade Serpent, right? The little girl tilts her head up at you inquisitively. I guess it's time you met her. Go smash the bad guys. Oh, okay then. 
I apologize for the deception, but it was necessary. In thousands of years, we have never seen one of your kind. It was imperative that I first measure the bearing of your heart. Come ride with me, little one. There is something I wish you to see. Yeah, just don't look at the history of our character, because in the history of our character, we have done some heinous and senseless acts of violence. Uh, for no other reason than the fact that we were on a different faction than other people. But it's nice that we're being portrayed as, the like, this great person. The are too frightened to face the truth. Ooh, look at I these views. Old, little look at one. That. My time on this world is nearly done. Do you see the great statue in the distance? Uh, the one that's the right here? have toiled for many years, and it is nearly complete. A little more jade, the jade you helped to acquire, and it will be finished. With my last breath, I will transfer my life essence into the statue, and a new guardian will be born. Do not be saddened. The cycle is clear. It neither begins nor ends with me. Someday, you may also be called upon to defend all that is dear to you. When that day comes, seek all the light and wonder of this world and fight. We live together or we die together. All of Pandaria is connected. I grow weary. I must rest now. Goodbye, little one. I will see you soon enough. Welcome. Spirits bless your path. Live for your dreams. Uh, well, we, we don't seem to have any more quests after that. That was the end of the chain. Let's come down here to the flight point. If we can find it, you know, it, it's down here somewhere, which means it is... Probably out and around, I guess. Let's go to the flight point and we'll see what else we can do. Kind of want to go take care of this over on the little island. What is going to get us closest? I, I think we have to take our chances over here. I'm kind of worried about this. Let's Maybe try here first, and then if that doesn't work, we'll fly a little bit further north. Uh, yeah, no, we probably should go up to the, to the village. We'll see. We'll see where this puts us and see if we can figure out a path over there. There's probably like a person we're supposed to click on to fly us over or something like that. Uh, I'm probably just going to attempt to swim it unless that person is really obvious right where we sat down. Yeah, see, that's a little far. Uh, that's a little far. Let's... Welcome. Let's try going up here. Oh, we have to fly around. That makes sense. Travel it makes perfect sense that we couldn't just do a straight line.
Okay, yeah, I guess we don't have this flight point that's over here. That's that's the problem. Let's go and take a look. We only have two more chapters to complete here in the Jade Forest. That's probably going to see us hit around level 30. Uh, which puts us, uh, you know, 20 levels out from level 50. Which is not a lot of time. Ooh, I, I kind of like this. Um, very scenic. Okay, well, I mean, from here, since I, I don't see anything really obviously taking us out here, probably just means that I missed something, right? Uh, but I'm going to try to swim it. <laughs> We're going to swim it and see if we can just get over here. And see if by getting over here we are able to find this. I give it about a 50-50 chance that it, the game lets us do this. And doesn't force us to uh, take a direct path uh, from an NPC or something. I feel like there was probably an NPC somewhere around the monastery that was willing to, to ride us out here when we first got the quest. I just have no idea where that person would be exactly, and I don't want to spend a bunch of time looking around for him. So we're going to try it this way, uh, which is what you would do in a game if you were trying to navigate somewhere. So I hope that it's opened up enough to let us actually do this. Looks good so far. I see a little path on the mini-map that looks like it might take us right down to where we need to go. Welcome. Thank goodness they finally sent someone. Things have gotten out of control, beating the odds. At first, the Slither Scale were too frightened to approach the wild serpents. Then, I caught them snatching the eggs under the cover of night. Now, they are slaughtering adults and hatchlings alike. If we do not do something, these gentle creatures will become completely wiped out. Then there won't even be an order of the Cloud Serpent to join. Go and slay these vile slither scales, and we will talk. Jade serpent guide. Oh, a bunch of other stuff, though. While you're doing that, do six other things so that you can feel like you're leveling faster. Empty nests. When the attacks began, the young hatchlings scattered in terror. They are roaming around the island lost and scared. If you want to help, take this rope and leash the little ones to it. Next one is on me. And egg collection. Ah, I should have known. You have the look of a hungry initiate. I would gladly help you choose a serpent egg. But the Slither Scale have thoroughly raided the Cloud Serpent Nest. I'm terribly sorry, I don't know what to tell you. Unless you're crazy enough to sneak into the Sarok camp to the east and retrieve some of the stolen Cloud Serpent eggs, I'm afraid I can't help you. There is no hurry. Okay.
I'm gonna get this little rope escort quest done first. Can we just, like, immediately turn this into him? Wait, how many do we need? Yeah, we need six. I think we have six. Return them to their nest. Um... Yeah? Where, where's their nest at? Is this not their nest? Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. I have no idea where their nest is, so... We'll see if we get this one done or not. I guess I'm just supposed to know what a cloud serpent nest looks like. Okay, this is a nest. <laughs> there we go. It doesn't seem like that's a safe place to return them to, which is what doesn't make sense to me. It's still surrounded by the same enemies that were the problem in the first place. But hey, whatever. Quest completed. It doesn't have to make perfect sense. In fact, it usually doesn't make sense. We obviously should have been fighting them over here while we were getting the eggs. That would have been the smart thing to do. Why would we do it the smart way? Oh, uh, this is probably not going to end well. Oh yeah, we're dead. Not a class that can do a lot of AoE damage. Not at all. Yeah, I feel I feel pretty useless when it comes to fighting more than three enemies at a time. Uh, which would be normal, but retail kind of sets a precedent for like big pulls and, and pulling lots of things. And uh, yeah, fun times. Uh, we will take it one or two enemies at a time, I guess.
Greetings, Wanderer. May the mists protect you. Jade Serpent guide you. Choosing the one, I have examined each egg. Out of the lot that you have brought me, I have chosen three eggs with the most promise. You may choose only one egg to take with you. Are you ready to make your selection? Let's go with the blue egg. Next one is on me. There is no hurry. Tell me of your travels. Excellent, just excellent. I will return the other eggs to their nest undisturbed. In the meantime, deliver your egg to Instructor Skythorn at the Arbor Arbitorium. Jade Serpent. Alright, uh, the Arbitorium, of course. Back that way. Uh, there's no flight point at all on this island, which is interesting. Huh. I guess we are swimming out the way we came in. They put flight points like literally a hundred yards from each other up here. But they don't put a single flight point on the island. I wonder what the thought process is behind that design. Oh good. Yep. Oh cool, we, we've somehow pissed this guy off. <laughs> oh, this makes sense. Yeah, sure. Oh good, another tiger. Perfect, perfect. I'm glad rolling still works in the water. That's amazing. Tell me of your travels. Ah yes, Elder Anil mentioned that a new student had joined our ranks. I see you already have chosen your Cloud Serpent Egg. I will instruct you on its care. Let me see it for a moment. Oh my, this egg is going to hatch any second. Well, it looks like this little guy is eager to meet you. There is no hurry. So we're not going to take care of it or whatever? We're just going to hatch right now? Are we going to take care of it after that? Am I going to get the ride this at some point? Normally, new trainees have a little more time to prepare. Unfortunately, your hatchling does not want to wait. I hope you work hard. To raise a cloud serpent is an honor bestowed upon a rare few. It's starting.
cool. Congratulations, it's a beautiful hatchling of your own. Please take care of it. May the mist protect Is it just a pet? I don't... I don't... Okay, I see. Oh, okay. So this is, like, optional. Okay, maybe I will do this stuff at one point. I I'm assuming this turns into, like, an actual hatchling. Um, um, I don't know, I don't know if that did anything. Are we, oh, we have to get to where it's going to land. Okay, okay. And then he's going to throw it again. Oh, this just keeps on going. We don't have control over it, like... Until it's done. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. How are we gonna do this kind of stuff? Like, how am I gonna fight and catch the ball? Yep. Fail. <laughs> Complete fail. Um, okay. Okay, that's done. Cool. What wisdom do you seek? The world is your teacher. And then what do we need over here? 30 honeycombs. Tell me of your travels. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Snack time. Sugar minnows. Farewell. Yeah, maybe we won't be doing all this stuff right now. As cool as that seems, I, I would like to see a little bit more of the actual uh, expansion in some of the different zones. And I feel like if I get sucked in on this right now, especially if it's giving us experience for all those, that that's like all we're going to do. Greetings. Let's come over here and get this turned in.
And back to talking to Nazgrim. It's been a while. I hope you were able to gather useful information while on your journey through the forest. Our preparations are almost complete, but your help is needed. The time for war is at hand. We've been training these native non-stop since you left, and I believe they're as good as they're going to get. See for yourself, check in with the others, and return with your findings. Our orders stand. No and sufficient motivation. Cost. Training these savages has been quite a task. Finding ways to motivate them was easy enough. The problem is keeping them motivated and focused and awake. Now that you're back, you can help me in getting the less disciplined Hosen moving if you catch my drift. May our yeah, I mean, we have some experience waking up lazy peons, so we should be able to handle this. Bucket of sticky water. That, that sounds just absolutely disgusting, but it's fine. Okay, we don't have to, like, pick it up over and over again, apparently. Uh, what do you need? Time is money, friend. Uh, we're just getting updates from these guys. Invalid target. I have to click them and then do it. Guys are hiding up in the trees. They didn't think we would look up, and we almost didn't. It's funny that she's the herbalism trainer, that doesn't really fit, fit her personality at all, but okay. And you are the skinning trainer. That's, that's fine. Disguising obscenities behind nonsense words. I'm pretty sure the Duker is like their F word. And I'm pretty sure that Blizzard had way too much fun with that concept while writing these guys. Some things don't come off really well years and years later, do they? <laughs> Keep your eyes peeled for the Alliance. Fear nothing. The Horde shall prevail. Okay, uh, now what? Lorewalker Cho and has a quest. Welcomes you. Last piece of the puzzle. These Hosen are behaving most unnaturally. Marching in formation? In armor? This troubles me. We must discuss it at another time, however. I have come to ask for your assistance. The ancient fresco where we last spoke is nearly unveiled. I am certain that it holds ancient wisdom, knowledge that the Emperor wanted us to remember. My meditations alone may not be enough to discern its meaning. Please take this heirloom to the shrine of my ancestors. I shall require their assistance. Farewell. Pretty sure like whatever picture it's going to be is going to be pretty obvious. 
Can we fly down there? Yeah, I think we should have the flight point for everywhere. Wait, 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 what is this? <laughs> what is this? Uh, I am ready to leave. I hope you're taking us to our quest objective. Oh, maybe we needed this guy, because maybe we're up on a plateau that's going to be hard to get up and down from. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, cutscene time. Didn't expect this. Don't remember this from my original playthrough years and years ago. Oh, Alliance versus Hosen. Great. Oh, that's right, they recruited the Jinyu. We just make the Beast Tribes fight for us. We, like, recruit them and, like, you guys go kill each other in the name of insert faction here. Hmm. A message must lie within. What fate? Did the Emperor foresee? Why is the lip syncing better in this cutscene than in Shadowlands cutscenes? Oh, big surprise. Well, damn. That's not good. Well, hi there. Yeah, we kind of unleashed you because we're a bunch of warmongering jerks. How does today find The you? legends, they're true. I, I thought the Shah of this immensity were a myth. We all did. Just a story to keep our children from fighting. No time to talk now. Those fissures, they're feeding it. It grows stronger by the moment. I must research the scrolls from my family archives. You, take this cannon and ride Misha. You must find a way to contain this horror that has been unleashed. He's like, I'm gonna go to the library. You, uh... You deal with all this. Tread lightly. I can't. I can't. <laughs> right into a vehicle quest. Perfect. I'm not sure what we're doing yet. Oh, we're sealing up the fissures. Okay, that is what we're doing. Oh, that was surprisingly easy. Hmm. 
Hello. I have much research to do in very little time. The Emperor's message only warned that the unique threat war would bring only warned of the unique threat war would bring to our land, this Shah. Sadly, the time to heed his message has passed. And as for how to bring an end to this crisis, the Emperor's omen is silent. Pandaria is a myth mystical land traveler. It bears repeating that some of its secrets remain hidden, even to lore walkers. Sealing those fissures did not mend what has been broken. If the legends are true, it will take much more to release this land from the grasp of the Shah. The aggression of that battle awakened a host of living negative emotions. What you see here is likely the first of many such manifestations. For now, we can only try to diminish their presence here. Destroy ten shot echoes. Eyes open. Oh, and other things. <laughs> uh, use the celestial jade chunks to defeat six Shah remnants. Jade serpent guide you. And use Cho's fireworks near General Nazgrim. Okay. Every good story needs Cool, cool, hero. cool. Let's go. Uh, you, you are an elite. You are, like, maybe a real elite. Am I supposed to have some kind of trick to defeat you? Maybe if I would have read more diligently, I would know this. The Great Jade Statue was soon to become a living serpent. Its construction imbued with special powers. Yeah, I have no idea what this wants me to do. Oh dear. Yeah, we're going to have to read this quest a little bit more thoroughly. I, I have no fucking idea what it wants me to do. It's kind of annoying. Suggest a solution. The Great Jade Statue was soon to become a living serpent, one of our revered celestials. Its construction imbued with special powers that may su sufficiently weaken these. Okay. So... So what? Am I supposed to lure it somewhere and fight it there? I I still don't know what it wants me to do with these. Do I have an item that it's not putting in, in the quest log? No, chose fireworks. What? What the heck? Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, I can read this over and over again. I fear I'd be of little help in terms of actual combat, but I can suggest a solution. <laughs> I'll read it more pronounced every time, and maybe that way I'll figure it out. The Great Jade Statue. Okay, is it that thing? Oh, God. It sucks because, like, things are usually really easy until they're just indecipherable. Here we go. Maybe it's this shit on the ground. Let's, let's try. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's what we needed. Now, somewhere in the quest, it could have said, the statue's been broken to pieces. Finding these pieces amongst the ruins may help you defeat the, the serpents. You know, something to actually allude to the fact that I'm going to be picking these up. That would have been nice. No wonder people don't bother reading the quests. There we go. I mean, they still kind of hit like a truck. At least we're rescuing our people and they're not all simply dead. Could have been worse.
kind of crazy to me that like a warrior played in retail has more self-healing than a windwalker monk the class actually has a healing spec and, and the warrior has more passive self-healing oh it's kind of crazy Tread lightly. Eyes open. Always be learning. Hey, there we go. There's 12 out of 12 complete. Someday I'm going to be a hero like you. Moving on. Your journey in this land has already proven most eventful traveler, and mine, it appears, is destined to continue for a time. The chain of events began when your people arrived here, and while some of those happenings are traumatic to behold, I feel there must be a larger purpose behind your presence. For now, it is wisest that you leave this place and explore Pandaria's other regions. Speak to me when you are ready to leave. Oh, we are Where ready are to go. Let's Bye -bye. go. It would have been nice if we did hit level 30. Again, we could have got flying first. Well, we'll get it in a couple minutes. This battle has extracted a heavy toll. My own rebirth will have to wait for several years. Learn from this stranger. I do not know why the mists have opened, but I know that it is for a reason. It is clear that you are not here to bring your war to these lands. There is a darkness hidden here in Pandaria. This you have seen for yourself. I am certain that the mist parted for a reason. You are that reason. Find your purpose here. You can learn a great deal about this land from the Valley of the Four Winds. There is another visitor from beyond the mists here. Chen Stormstout, he is called. He is Pandaren, but from a different homeland. Oh, well, that's interesting. I didn't Chen know that. Your side. Make friends among the people here. You will find answers in time. Feels like we were in that forest forever. Let's go. We've got to explore the valley. Do not be too hasty, Eli. This is how I traveled Kalimdor. One stop at a time. No wonder it took you so long then. You can't explore anything sitting on your butt. Oh, it's Lily. 
I know you from Heroes of the Storm. Oh, right. <laughs> I guess I know you both from Heroes of the Storm. I know you more from Heroes of the Storm than I do from uh, this expansion originally. <laughs> I played it pretty good, Lily. Prove to these inhabitants that there is more to your people than war and destruction. Hey, yo. Feels like we were in that forest forever. Let's go. We've got to explore the valley. Shh, do not be too hasty, Lily. Oh, we're doing the this same dialogue again? That's great. One stop at a time. No wonder it took you so long then. My niece and I are new to Pandaria, probably like yourself. We're visitors from the Wandering Isle, and to be honest, we have no idea where we're going. That farm up ahead looks like a fine place to, as any to take off our shoes and enjoy a brew. I travel well. You have some priority issues. Finally! Finally, we're gonna move 20 feet over here, and then stop moving again. I am called Chen, and this is my niece, Lili. May we stay here at your farmhouse for a while? We do not have much in the way of money, but I will gladly share some of my famous ale with you. Greetings, Chen. Lili, you may stay, <laughs> but I do not need any of your ale. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I will not trouble you for long. What Interesting. do you see? He does not like beer. A very strange land, indeed. Hmm. Really, Uncle? We're stopping already? We only moved, like, ten feet. A at least they address it. <laughs> welcome, welcome, visitors. You're, you've come to sample some of my son's turnips? Perhaps purchase a few pigs? Uh, no. I apologize for the state of things around here. The vermin, those rabbity creatures down the hill, have been pushing further and further into my family's farm and our crops, which are normally bigger and more delicious, by the way, have been suffering because of it. I'm no soldier, but you might be. Would you mind pushing some of these vermin out of our lands? Yeah, we go from world-ending threats to vermin hunting. Perfect. And what do you have going? You want us to unearth seven pieces of farm equipment. Can these be hunter pets? Because it would be amazing to have this as a hunter pet. <laughs> it would never get annoying. Never. Uh, we need the large vermin as well. We could probably do this somewhere where the quest can overlap a little bit. That would be smart. Oh good, dismounted immediately. And that is level 30. I thought we were supposed to be uncovering farm equipment, but all I seem able to uncover is more of these stupid vermin. 
so I'm not really sure what the deal is with that. Cool to like see an example of an actual tool buried in the ground so I know just what the heck I'm looking for. Okay. Maybe it's these. Okay. So it's not the dirt. The dirt holes are going to uncover little rabbits and the sparkly things because all items in a while that you need have to sparkle now. Uh, the sparkly things. Okay, you just go do your thing, I guess. this whatever it is we can't use it here uh, let's equip that and that we have an unspent talent point increase your maximum chi by one sounds good Great. Makes sense as soon as they tap us that we're going to get dismounted. Alright guys, we are going to take a break here. I am going to take us to Ogremar and get flying. I think that's going to help us out a lot. And yeah, we'll just here. resume here next time. Now, where are we getting flying from? Hmm, how are we getting back out of this place? Tell me a story before you that's go. a good question. Do I have a way out? Uh, I have a portal to Ogremar way up here at the Honeydew Village. But I don't think I have a flight point for the Honeydew Village. Who are you supposed to be? Yeah, I have nothing. <laughs> where are you going? Ah, uh, lovely. I don't really know why I don't have that. Was it something that I just did? I didn't pick it up right away. Anyway, I'm going to run there and I'm going to get us back to Orgrimmar. Get us trained in flight and then we'll resume next time, guys. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate you spending your time here with me in Azeroth. And a special thank you to those of you who are members on the YouTube channel and those of you who are with me on Patreon. Thank you so much. It's that kind of support that's going to help me keep doing what I do long into the future, so I very much appreciate it. Take care of yourselves out there, and take care of each other. 
and we'll see you back in Azeroth again real soon. Bye now.